In the studio now, Daniel Miljone. Uh, you are a product manager for alternative fuels at Scania. Nice to have you here. Thank you very much. Uh, which are the advantages of ethanol as uh, an alternative fuel? Well, at Scania, when we are evaluating if a fuel or a sustainable fuel is commercially viable, we look at three factors. The first one being that uh, it has to reduce CO2. The second part is that it must be available in sufficient quantities in the world to make a difference. And the third part is that the pricing must be correct of it. And when we look at ethanol, the two major parts that we have is that it is the fuel that is available in largest quantities in the world. And the environmental performance of it can be absolutely fantastic, up to 90%. But it has taken a really long time. It seems so difficult for ethanol to really break through. Why? Well, ethanol has the same challenges as any other alternative fuel. That is that the mix between fuel availability, uh, tank infrastructure and pricing must be correct for customers to dare to, uh, to go for this. And, uh, and it's uh, often uh, the policies and regulations of the societies that is vital for this to happen. And it's really important also to get long-term decisions on, for example, taxes uh, for alternative fuels for customers to dare to go for this. But if you look at the engine technology and, and the environmental performance, ethanol is excellent as a fuel for, for heavy transport. And today, is the interest growing? Definitely. Uh, if you look at transport buyers, we are now seeing a trend where there are starting to come companies that are setting hard targets on sustainability that they need to deliver on. And ethanol would then be one, uh, one of the really good fuels to use for their operations. Uh, if we look at cities, they are also starting to set demands mainly to, uh, to reduce air pollution in the cities. Uh, Paris, for example, will prohibit the use of diesel vehicles in heavy transports by 2020, and ethanol would then be one of the uh, excellent choices to, to go for instead of diesel. Scania has been in this game for a long time. Are you optimistic for the future? Definitely. If we look at the technology, we know that it really works and it's robust. Uh, and we are seeing now a growing customer interest as well. So ethanol will definitely be there in the future. Daniel Milione, thank you so much for visiting Scania Studio. Thank you very much. And thank you for watching.